Jason's been gone for a year, and maybe he would think that it's a good thing to be pushed finally by somebody. Here's Stephen McCain. Steve said one of the best moves he ever made was moving to the National Training Center in Colorado. He said there is absolutely no guesswork. Everything is done for me. How can you not be the best athlete being in that surrounding? Very tricky combination. He's a little bit off here. Body form is way off on his handstands. Yeah, this is odd, actually. Looks far shakier than typical. And a double back. Tucks the dismount. They grabs the ball. Morris totally loose. Came all the way out. Yeah, he's talking the the T handle on the parallel bar. He's saying is loose, and each Another gymnast has their I mean, own. I tightened all four of them myself, and it just came off. Each gymnast has their own setting, and if it loosens up, I mean, I tightened all four. I went through them twice. No, it came all the way undone. I was swinging this way. And that is, that's a huge problem when that occurs. Uh, finishing six rotations is tough enough. I, I, I can't imagine if he'd have the strength to do seven, which I mean would mean doing this routine over again. Well, if they can Well, I don't know. I tightened all four myself physically. I mean, I cranked on him, and he went, and this whole side came open, and the rail just opened up for him. If it is equipment failure, then he will be given an opportunity to repeat the exercise or he can take a score. Uh, he can take a score. And like you said, though, Al, this is... Carrie, the, the, I think the parallel bars need some adjusting. Okay? Um, it was very clear. He, he, the the bars got tightened out. Mark right? Graham. And when, he, when Ron went over to check the bars, he was technical director And I the saw meet. the bar move. So I, and I don't think it was the coach's fault. In other words, the coach basically did his job, but yes. the equipment failed. There was an equipment that, failure. They let him try the whole... Uh, that's the critical thing. The if the bars equipment yeah. failure and... Harry Berkey is right on track as usual. We'll go ahead and you got to give the benefit to the athlete if he wants it, but that's a risky situation to be in. Because it wasn't a totally blown routine, but uh, he, he does have a chance to make up some areas that were not so great in the routine. So remember, he was coming off a of 9-1, and you said the new Stephen McCain would be able to move past it. Okay, so you try and forget the 9-1. Now in your very next rotation, you have a very odd occurrence, which could force you to be pushed to a very high level of physical exhaustion. And here he goes for a second go at it. You know, I think the mental component is actually, it's actually a little bit worse, though, because you're, right now, he's and right there, he's probably thinking, maybe this wasn't such a good idea. Small little break on that mount. This is the most tricky part of the routine in combination. The only way if we're going to be able to tell if this was the right decision is if you can tell me what you think his score would have been and we compare it to what he gets here. Well, right now, no question about it. This is a Form far superior routine. Superior distance. Going to get about a point and a half better than the other routine would have brought in. Good job. He was fourth coming in. And look, look at his arms, though. That's the thing. You know, he does two of those double back elements. And Get a little chewed up. A little chewed up. Meanwhile, in this age of computers, some things in gymnastics are still done by hand. We'll crunch the numbers for Stephen McCain in a moment.